yesterday. Curious, 15th of the month too. My first birthday away from home. Separation. Remember the summer morning she was born, running to knock up Mrs. Thornton in Denzel Street. Jolly old woman. Lots of babies she must have helped into the world. Knew from the first poor little Rudy wouldn't live. Well, God is good, sir. She knew it once. He would be 11 now if he lived. His vacant face stared pitying at the postscript. Excuse bad writing, hurry, piano downstairs. Coming out of her shell. Row with her in the Excel cafe about the bracelet. She wouldn't eat her cakes or speak or look. Sauce box. He sopped other dyes of bread in the gravy and ate piece after piece of kidney. Twelve and six a week, not much. Still, she might do worse. Music hall stage. Young student. He drank a draught of cooler tea to wash down his meal. Then he read the letter again. Twice. Ah oh well, she knows how to mind herself. But if not, no, nothing has happened. Of course it might. Wait in any case until it does. A wild piece of goods. Her slim legs running up the staircase. Destiny. Ripening now. Vain. Oh, very. He smiled with troubled affection at the kitchen window. Day I caught her in the streets, pinching her cheeks to make them red, anemic a little, was given milk too long. On the errands king that day, round the kish, damned old tub pitching about, not a bit funky. Her pale blue scarf loose in the wind with her hair. All dimpled cheeks and curls, your head it simply swirls. Seaside girls. Torn envelope, hands stuck in his trousers pockets, Jarvie off for the day singing, friend of the family, swirls, he says, peer with lamps, summer evening, band.